Hi friends, I am Balaji Rao. Welcome to TR Max class. In this class, we will learn how to solve linear differential equation. This is third class in solving linear differential equations. If you want previous two classes, I will give the link in the cards. You can find it. So, let's quickly recall what is linear differential equation. What is the procedure to solve linear differential equation? A differential equation is of the form dy by dx plus py equal to q is called linear differential equation. What is the procedure to solve linear differential equation? First, we will identify the functions p and q from the given differential equation. Once you identify what is p, what is q, then we will calculate integrating factor by using the formula e power integral of p dx. Then we will write solution of the differential equation. You need to remember this solution in linear differential equation. What is the solution of this differential equation? y into integrating factor equal to integral of q into integrating factor into dx. Now let us solve this problem. You observe this solve differential equation. You observe here they are not specified it is a linear differential equation. Solve differential equation x into dy by dx plus 2y equal to x square into log x. If you observe this differential equation, we cannot identify directly it is of the form dy by dx plus py equal to q. You observe here dy by dx coefficient is 1. Here dy by dx coefficient is x. So, I will simplify this little bit so that we can easily identify it is a linear differential equation form. You divide this complete equation with x. Divide this complete equation with x. What you will get here? You will get that dy by dx plus here when we are dividing with x, this x will get cancelled plus 2 divided by x into y equal to as we are dividing with x, x square by x, x square by x is x. So, this will be x log x. I hope you understand this. I divided this complete equation with x. When I divide with x here, x by x will get cancelled, you will get 1 here. When I divide with x here, it is 2 by x. When I divided by x, x square by x is x. So, you observe it is of the form dy by dx plus py equal to q. So, it is linear differential equation because it is of the form dy by dx plus py equal to q. Now, what is the procedure to solve linear differential equation? First, we will identify the functions p and q. What is p? Yes. What is p? Can you say what is p? dy by dx plus py. What is p? p is 2 divided by x. q. What is q? dy by dx plus py equal to q. You can compare this equation. You compare this equation with this equation. What is q? q is x into log x. So, we completed first step in this. We identified the functions p and q. Now, what is the second step? We need to calculate integrating factor. What is the formula to calculate integrating factor? Integrating factor. Integrating factor formula is what? e power integral of p dx. That equal to e power integral of what is p? p is 2 by x, 2 by x dx, that equal to e power, as 2 is constant, we can write it outside the integral, 2 into integral of 1 by x dx, that equal to e power 2 into, we learn integration formulas, you know integral of 1 by x dx, what is integral of 1 by x dx? Integral of 1 by x dx is log x base e. So, this is what? This is log x base e. And we know this formula in logarithms. What formula it is? Uh, logarithm of a power m. Logarithm of a power m is what? m into log a. Logarithm of a power m formula? m into log a. So, here 2 log x base e. 2 log x base e. It can be written as e power logarithm of x square base e. You please identify this is m log a. m log a. m log a can be written as logarithm of a power m. Logarithm of x square. So, you observe here 
a power log m base a. What is the formula for a power log m base a? The formula for a power log m base a is m. So here e power log m. What is m here? m is x square. Please try to understand. a power log m base a is m. So here what is m here? x square. So we calculated integrating factor. So what is integrating factor? Integrating factor is x square. So step 1 is completed. We identified what is p, what is q. Step 2 is calculated. We identified, we calculated integrating factor. What is step 3? Solution of the given linear differential equation. Okay, solution. Solution of given linear differential equation is, uh, what is the formula? y into integrating factor equal to integral of q into integrating factor into dx. Okay, so here uh, you must and should remember this to do this problem. Y into what is integrating factor? Integrating factor is x square. Y into x square equal to integral of q. What is q? q is x into log x into integrating factor. What is integrating factor? Integrating factor is x square into dx. So, y into x square equal to integral of, integral of, here this can be written as log x into, x into x square is what? x into x square is x cube dx. Now, the problem starts here. How to calculate this expression? Here, uh, y into x square equal to, how to integrate this expression? Yes. How to integrate this expression? We use integration by parts. What is integration by parts? I will write simple thing here to remember this. Integral of first function into second function into dx equal to first function into integral of second function minus integral of derivative of first function, derivative of first function into integral of second function into dx. This is simplest way to remember this formula, integration by parts formula. So, which one is first function, which one is second function, how to decide? We know in integration by parts, i late. You observe here, one is logarithmic function, you mark it, this is logarithmic function, x cube, x cube is algebraic function. So, one is logarithmic function, one is algebraic function. So, which function comes first? Logarithmic function. You observe here, logarithmic function is the first function. So, algebraic function is the second function. It is in right order only. So, what is the first function here? Log x. What is the second function here? x cube. Now, you start writing, applying this formula. What is integration by parts formula? First function. What is first function? Log x into integral of second function. Integral of x cube dx minus integral of uh, derivative of first function. Derivative of what is first function? First function is log x into integral of second function. Second function is what? x cube dx into dx. Now, if we simplify this further, what you will get? That equal to log x into integral of x cube dx. Basic integration is compulsory to do this problem. Integral of x cube dx. We know the formula for integral of x power n dx. Integral of x power n dx is x power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1. Integral of x cube dx is what? x power 3 plus 1, 4 divided by 4. This is simple formula. Integral of derivative of log x. Derivative of log x is 1 by x. We learned this formula in differentiation. So, derivative of log x is 1 by x. Integral of x cube dx is what? Integral of x cube dx is x power 4 by 4 into dx. Here you observe 1 x will get cancelled, x cube will be there. So, what you will get? That equal to log x into x power 4 divided by 4 minus here 1 by 4 is constant. You take it outside. 1 by 4 is constant. Take it outside. What is remaining here? Integral of, uh, what is remaining? Integral of x cube dx. What is the formula for integral of x cube dx? Integral of x cube dx formula is x power 4 divided by 4 plus c. So, what is the general solution for given differential equation? y into x square equal to log x into x power 4 by 4 minus, 
You can simplify this x power 4 divided by 16 plus c. I hope you understand how to solve linear differential equation. Now we will try to understand this more clearly with one more example. Okay, second problem in linear differential equation. You observe this differential equation x log x into dy by dx plus y equal to 2 by x into log x. Is it is a linear differential equation? Actually, directly it is not in that form. What is linear differential equation? It is in the form of dy by dx plus py equal to q. dy by dx coefficient must be 1. So, what I will do here, I will divide this complete equation with x log x. Divide this complete equation with x log x. Then what you will get? You will get this dy by dx plus 1 divided by x into log x into y. You observe here, I divided this expression with x log x. Then x log x, x log x will get cancelled. dy by dx is remaining. Plus, as I am dividing with x log x, 1 divided by x log x into y equal to 2 by x into log x divided by x log x. Okay. Now, a uh, little bit of simplification we will do here. This log x, log x will get cancelled. I will write one more step. What is this? dy by dx plus I will write a simple step here which will be useful later in the simplification. What I will do here, I will write this 1 divided by x log x as 1 by x divided by log x into y equal to 2 by x divided by x. That is what? That is 2 divided by x square. 2 by x divided by x. That is 2 divided by x square. I hope you are understanding. It's simple calculation only. I divided this complete equation with x log x and we got this expression. You observe here, it is of the form dy by dx plus py equal to q. So, it is a linear differential equation. What is step 1 to solve this linear differential equation? We will identify what is p, what is q. What is p? p is equal to 1 by x divided by log x. What is q? q is 2 divided by x square. Okay. Now, first step is over. We identified what is p, what is q. Second step is what? We need to calculate integrating factor. Integrating factor. What is the formula to calculate integrating factor? e power integral of p dx. That equal to e power. What is p? p is 1 by x divided by log x into dx that equal to e power you observe here derivative of log x is what derivative of log x is 1 by x so we know this formula in integration integral of f dash of x divided by f of x dx if numerator is the derivative of denominator what is its answer its answer is logarithm of f of x base e plus c so, numerator is the derivative of denominator. Derivative of log x is 1 by x. So, what you will get here? Log of f of x. f of x means denominator. What is denominator here? Denominator is log x base e. So, here you observe it is of which form? It is of which form? a power log m base a. You look here. What is the formula for a power log m base a? a power log m base a is m. So, what you will get here? You will get log x. So, what is integrating factor? Integrating factor is log x. So, step 2 is also over. Now, what to, can, what to write? Solution. You need to remember this. So, I will write here solution, solution of given linear differential equation is what is the solution? y into integrating factor equal to integral of q into integrating factor into dx okay y into what is integrating factor integrating factor is log x log x equal to integral of q what is q q is 
2 divided by x square into integrating factor. Integrating factor is what? Log x into dx. You observe here product of two functions is there. How we integrate this? We use integration by parts. Okay. So, uh, in integration by parts, we use the rule called I let. I let. You observe one is logarithmic function, one is algebraic function. Which function comes first? Logarithmic function. But here, algebraic function is first. So, I will rearrange the terms like this y into log x equal to integral of log x into 2 divided by x square dx y into log x equal to what is integration by parts formula first function log x to integral of second function we know this formula integral of 1 divided by x power n dx is minus 1 divided by n minus 1 into x power n minus 1 this formula works good when n is not equal to 1. So, here n is 2. So, it is not equal to 1. So, we can use this formula to write uh, integral of 1 by x square dx. As 2 is constant, you take it outside. Integral of 1 by x square dx. Integral of 1 by x square dx. Please try to understand. Integral of 1 by x square dx. What you will get? Minus 1 divided by uh, in place of n. 2. 2 minus 1? 1 into x power 2 minus 1, 1. So, integral of 1 by x square dx is minus 1 by x. First function into integral of second function minus integral of derivative of first function. Derivative of log x formula is what? 1 by x into integral of second function. Integral of second function just to be calculated here now. 2 is constant. Integral of 1 by x square dx is what? Minus 1 divided by x dx. Now, if you simplify this further, what you will get? y into log x equal to uh, minus 2 into log x divided by x minus minus of minus plus 2 into what is remaining here? 2 minus minus plus na 2 is taken outside. What is remaining? Integral of 1 by x square dx. What is integral of 1 by x square dx? That is minus 1 by x. By using this formula, integral of 1 by x square dx is minus 1 by x plus c. So, finally, we got the solution for given linear differential equation. Solving linear differential equation is very easy. Only the thing is you need to remember few steps. First thing is you identify it is of the form dy by dx plus py equal to q. And then we will remember three steps to solve. Uh, first step is identifying the functions p and q. Second step is calculating integrating factor. Third step is writing its solution directly by remembering solution of the linear differential equation. What is the solution of linear differential equation? y into integrating factor equal to integral of q into integrating factor into dx. I hope you understand this class. If you like this video, please share it with your friends. If you are not yet subscribed to my YouTube channel, subscribe now. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.